Hi there. I'll be walking you through a tool I built called Font Tester that can help you with picking and testing fonts for your websites and help you with brand identity. We all know that 80% of a website is text and how you present your text matters a lot. So, whether you are a creative agency, web developer, or a type designer, you'll find this tool to be of immense value. So let's dive right in. When you open the extension, the first thing you'll notice is how you can move it around the web page. This is super handy when you want to move it around your page. Let's start by highlighting some text on a web page. Now from the drop-down menu, select a typeface. And voila, that's it, instant font preview right there. And now the best part of this tool is that it can even generate the CSS code for the selected font, saving you time. Another great feature is the multi-font compare tool, allowing you to instantly compare multiple fonts on your website with just a click. And as you see, it instantly previews your website with the selected fonts, making it easy to compare and choose the perfect fit. You can also expand to see it in full screen for better preview and copy the code for it. Now to preview custom fonts, just upload using the upload button and you can find all the uploaded fonts in the settings menu. Another cool little feature is the font finder tool we have here. Once you click on it, you can instantly find the font being used on this web page, and you can copy the CSS code for the font from here. Okay, let's now see what we have in the settings. So here we have got a couple of toggle buttons. Let's go over them one by one. The first one here is a dark mode toggle. So if you are sensitive to light, you can toggle to the dark mode. The second in the list is cycle fonts on key. So what this does is preview fonts on the web page, even if you scroll the drop down with your arrow keys. This is quite useful if you don't feel like using the mouse or something. The last one is preview fonts on drop down. So if you disable this for whatever reason, you'll only see the names of the fonts on the drop down and not the preview. That's about the settings. Now let's explore more features of the extension. Let's start with this filter we have here. This nice little feature helps you narrow down fonts by category. You can even filter out Google fonts if you're focusing on local ones. Now let's move on to the random button we have here. So as the button says, it picks a font at random. A great way to get started if you are a bit confused. This tool is all about making great fonts pick. So of course you can adjust line, height, weight, set to italic, add underline, and more. Now if we go down here to the advanced features, you'll be able to adjust font size, color, letter spacing, and underline spacing. If you ever want to reset the fonts, you can click on the reset button. And if you no longer want to highlight text, you can disable it here. There you have it one of the best typography tools out there that you can download. I had an absolute pleasure using this. Hope you guys do too. Thank you for watching.